Good morning, everyone. Um, uh, firstly, I'd just like to thank Chini Mandi for providing us with the platform to uh, present our solution uh, to all the esteemed guests over here. Um, we ha since yesterday, we've been hearing a lot of sugar industry members uh, talk about some of the challenges that the sugar industry is facing in terms of uh, you know, improving the yield uh, from sugarcane plots and then uh, the objective here is that can technology actually play a role in boosting uh, yield uh, per acre and can it also help in boosting recovery which can not only benefit the mills but also other stakeholders like the farmers and also the government in taking you know policy decisions that uh, are, are good for the industry. Uh, so our objective through this exercise was, I mean, we started this project four years ago and uh, the objective was we met a lot of sugar mills and, uh, you know, we realized that uh, technology intervention at the mill level is, is, is uh, just starting uh, and there's no tech solution available uh, by which the mills can actually, uh, most of the overseeing of plots, etc., is done manually. Uh, and so can we, we thought can technology play a role in that and so with certain focus areas like uh, improving recovery or estimating recovery, uh, crop health monitoring, uh, yield in estimation, uh, uh, we decided to come up with our product which is called the smart harvesting solution. Uh, and during the course of our interaction with sugar mills we realized that you know some of the challenges that mills face uh, include uh, estimating the correct area, registered area that they have under uh, each under, under the mill. Uh, quality supply of sugar cane is an issue. Uh, and a lot of cane development activities take place, but there's, it, it, it is very difficult for the mills to track whether the right amount of fertilizer, whether the right amount of nutrition or, or, or uh, intervention is taking place at the right time or not. Moreover, even it is difficult for the mills to track uh, when the harvesting of a plot has started or whether the, the harvesting of a plot is complete or not. So we came up with a very simple uh, AI based uh, solution for the sugar mills. Uh, this is what our dashboard looks like. It's a web based platform that allows mills to study their entire catchment area on one single page and they can plot wise they can see insights like uh, the sugar content of each mill. They can then check whether which plot is actually ready to be harvested, which plot isn't ready to be harvested, and they can also check the the harvest status of each plot. Uh, how we do this is we combine most of the data that a sugar mill collects during the time of registration. So, for example, the variety that is sown, uh, the season of the crop, whether it's fresh or ratoon. Um, and we also collect uh, the boundary data of each plot. We combine that with hyperlocal weather forecasts, and we also uh, combine that with uh, deeply resolved or highly uh, high resolution satellite imagery. Uh, we combine all these three and we run it through a proprietary AI model, and that then helps us uh, to give the outputs, which we validate using actual ground data at the sugar mills labs. These are some of the uh, inputs that go into our model and uh, currently we provide three insights to uh, sugar mills. One is pollen in cane percent, second is yield estimation and the third is harvest status detection. Uh, the use of uh, the pollen cane is mainly to develop, to incorporate quality of cane uh, into your harvesting program which is mostly age based and what we've seen is that this can drastically improve recovery at a sugar mill. Um, these are some of the different uh, responsibilities that, uh, you know, we basically, uh, so what role does the mill have to play in this entire process is basically just provide us with your registration data and help us validate and test the outputs from a small percentage of uh, your registered area. Uh, so the most important bit is what outcomes have we delivered at, at the different sugar mills. 
Um, so, you know, we've, we've, we've steadily grown from uh, starting with a couple of mills to then doing, implementing the solution at 12 sugar mills in FY23. Uh, overall, we've, we've implemented this across the four years on roughly two and a half lakh acres of land. And our accuracy numbers are, uh, I would say, are ex excellent when it comes to sugar content uh, prediction. Uh, we, we are able to track the sugar content of each plot with a 98% accuracy and um, yield prediction accuracy is about 90%. Um, uh, some of our partners, were, uh, some of the partners were present here yesterday. Uh, we've implemented this at DCM Sriram in UP. Uh, they've been our partner for four years. We've implemented this, this at EID Pari in Tamil Nadu and uh, the other states where we've implemented this is in, uh, in Maharashtra, Madhya Pradesh, Haryana and uh, Karnataka. Uh, and by simply incorporating this pollen cane aspect, which is, which is a reflection of the quality of cane, into your harvesting program, we've actually helped mills boost sugar recovery by uh, roughly 0.32%. Uh, I also want to highlight a success story from Maharashtra, where in year one at Sanjeevni uh, Sugar Mill uh, in Kopargaon, where over the years, you know, the mill first started with actually testing out this program and testing the accuracy. And during this year, they've implemented the entire solution and the harvesting has been done purely using our SHS program. Uh, these are some additional features that we offer as part of our offering, which is one of them being, uh, you know, so mills during registration spend a lot of time uh, in collecting field boundaries manually. But we want to simplify this process uh, by uh, our, our tool, which is called Automatic Field Boundary Detection, where you provide us with a single location of the plot or single latitude, longitude, and we are able to uh, identify and draw the boundary using historical satellite imagery. Uh, the second bit is, you know, uh, is more for to more regarding the improvement of uh, sugarcane sugar yields in the crop. So if we are able to track uh, some of the key growth parameters of uh, the sugarcane crop during its grand growth stage, then that will improve the yield per acre. And, and I think with limited land available for, for cultivation of sugarcane and you know, with the objective of, of improving our ethanol, of producing more ethanol, I think some of these features are extremely relevant uh, from those points as well. Just uh, an example that I, I would like to show of the FBD. On the, on the screen, you can see some of the images that have been, the, some of the uh, plot boundaries that have been collected by, manually by the field team. And you can see that there's a lot of, sometimes there's, there's a huge overlap in the boundaries that are collected. And uh, the boundaries are inaccurate. So our estimations of how much yield we'll get or how much area of sugarcane do we have under cultivation is, is wrong to start with. And therefore, we can, uh, we can correct this uh, using satellite imagery and AI. Uh, and you can see how on the left, uh, this, this, the, the picture shows incorrect boundaries and how they've been corrected uh, using our tool on the right-hand side. And we also exclude things like residential areas and wells in, in, in the plots. This is another example. Um, I think it is more clearly shown on the uh, bottom left plot where we actually collected the, collected the boundary and identified the right uh, area under sugarcane cultivation. This is crop health monitoring where we are able to tell you which plots uh, of your registered area are actually under, say, uh, under pest attack, or they have any, they have nitrogen deficiency, or whether they have water stress. Uh, so this is the farmer should not either overwater or underwater its fields, and we can also see the same thing uh, for the individual plot, as shown on the right hand side. Uh, so that's the presentation from our end. Um, I would. I mean, we've had many success stories during the last four years, and we'd, uh, I'd encourage you to, to either speak with us or uh, also with our, with our sugar mill partners. And in case, you can also reach out to Chini Mandi, uh, who are now our official 
uh, channel partner uh, for this this product uh, project thank you so much